Many of us spend hours in the garden on weekends, doing bits here, bits there, all to improve our personal quiet space. But in every garden, there lies a silent threat, pests. However, many people, including myself, prefer to avoid using traditional insecticides or insect poisons as we know them. But did you know that there are natural ways to control pests? They are organic, eco-friendly, liquid-based insecticides and they don't harm the pollinators, you know, bees and the other friendly chaps. Just try to avoid spraying the flower as you don't want to chase your pollinators away and instead focus on spraying the leaves, both top and bottom, branches and twigs. Now, a lot of eco-friendly insecticides have some kind of oil in them, so it's better to spray in the early morning or late afternoon. This allows time for that oil to be absorbed and the carrier liquids to evaporate. Oily leaves can get burnt by the sun, causing further damage to your plants. Now products like Margaret Roberts Organic Insecticide and Ludwig's Insect Spray Plus, they use canola oil and garlic as their main base ingredient, although in varying ratios. Now the canola oil suffocates the pests like aphids, red spider mites and white fly on contact, while the garlic chases the newcomers away. You can safely eat edible crops after just 24 hours, which is way quicker than chemical insecticides that can take weeks. Plus, these products are safe for fish, birds, pets, and of course, people. Oleum is another oil-based organic insecticide that targets a variety of pests, including my garden nemesis, mealybug. It has a mayonnaise-like consistency, but when properly mixed with water, it sprays easily, covering the insects or their eggs. Dealing with insect pests the green way is one thing, but controlling snails and ants the eco-friendly way is actually easier than you may think, thanks to baits and granules. Snails can quickly chew through large amounts of plant matter. These nocturnal guys hide during the day in sheltered spots, but as the temperature drops at night and the dew forms, they magically appear, ready to feast. Now, Zero Snail is an eco-friendly, non-toxic bait designed to control snails and slugs. It's a non-secondary infection product, meaning that if you see a bird eating a snail from your garden, don't worry, the bird will be fine. But please, this is not an invitation to do your own escargot. To use, scatter the pellets evenly in small amounts around or close to plants that you want to protect. Snails only need to eat a small quantity for the effects to kick in. The pellets are made from bran and are infused with iron. The bran attracts the snails. The high iron content causes them to lose their appetite and retreat into hiding, where their story comes to an end. Ants are another common pest in our gardens and their nests can grow into large underground colonies with thousands of residents. Now, while I believe there's no natural remedy solely for the control of ants, Nippet Ant Control is an effective option with low toxicity for both humans and animals. Instead of acting as a contact poison, these sugar-coated granules are carried back to the colony where they're fed to the queen and other ants. This method leads to infection and eradication within a week. Now, application is simple. Lightly spread the granules around the perimeter of the nest when no rain is forecast for the next few days. However, avoid touching the granules with your hands. If the ant detects your scent on them, they're not gonna take the bait. As you tackle those garden pests, remember that eco-friendly solutions can make a real difference to your plants whilst keeping your gardens safe for birds and beneficial creatures. Builder stocks a wide range of organic pest control options available in store or online at builders.co.za. For more videos like this, check out the blog on the website. It's due day for a healthier garden and a happier planet. Get to Builders, get it done.